All right, so I wanted to put together this video is what do you do when you get massive opposition? Uh, I almost put what do you do when you get when you get hit in the gut or when you get another word is when you get persecuted or someone in your family, a friend, a client, uh, someone you're trying to prospect in your business, what do you do when they come at you with, is this one of those things, or those things don't work, or your product didn't work, or, or I can't even believe you're doing one of those business models, or one of those network marketing things. Look, let me just share something with you. And this is such an interesting analogy. You know, I always ask people, what news do you ever watch? Like, if, do you ever watch a news channel? Like, let's just say CNN as an example. Um, do you watch CNN or are you a Fox person? One thing I'm really realizing, especially with these new political climate that's going on here in America, is that the people at CNN, uh, the people that watch CNN and the people that watch Fox don't understand each other. The opposition in America and the views are so radically different right now and there's probably not that much that a person from Fox or that watches uh, Fox is gonna do to try to convert someone that believes what the people believe at CNN and vice versa. Do you get that? So here's what I mean, is that our job in our industry is to go out there and talk to people, connect with them as best that we can. And if you do everything right to talk to them about your product, do everything right to talk to them about your business, can I just tell you something? you're still gonna get massive opposition. You know, even God <laughs> had massive persecution and he was uh, had one of the best messages in the history of the world, which is eternity and peace and joy and just teaching people how to have a relationship with him. But he had massive opposition. Um, it's the same thing with us and our businesses. No matter how good our industry is, we have one of the best models, if not the best model, in the history of business in the world. The network marketing business is, there's nothing better. I just, I mean, you look at it from a whole and you look at all the other great business models in the world, network marketing is powerful. And you have to understand that you're going, it's just the way that it's gonna work is you're going to get massive persecution, opposition, hit in the gut. The thing that you gotta do is just do, do something that very few people do. You wanna know why most people fail in network marketing? You wanna know why most people fail in building a business? Is because they get hit once, they get back up. They get knocked down by their uncle, Bob, who, uh, you know, who's never been in a business before in his life. They get hit by a customer or someone on Facebook that's trashing them or persecuting them or negative about their business and they fall down again. And then this time, they don't get back up. I want you to understand that you don't even have to fall when you get hit or when you get uh, a negative uh, hater or someone that challenges you or says something negative about your product or your business. You don't even have to fall down. You just have to realize that there's nothing you can do no matter how good you are, no matter how great your presentation was, no matter how great your products and or your business is, sometimes, there's nothing you can do with people that are challenging you. You just gotta learn that this is the process that it's going to take you. This is the refinement that it takes for you to earn the kind of money that we have the ability to earn within our industry and within your company. That's part of the refinement that you're gonna need to go through as a leader that's going to make you stronger as a leader, that's going to give you the ability to when people join you in your business and they get hurt, they get emotionally sidetracked by someone that said something, you can lovingly and firmly say, I went through that myself and here's what I did or send him this video. Um, because it's just part of the process. In fact, it's the way that it works. It's the way that it's supposed to happen. And I've tried to avoid it with my team, tried to help them mitigate, and I just realized there's always gonna be the opposite view. There's always gonna be an enemy. There's always gonna be someone who just, no matter, that just doesn't understand. There's always gonna be someone out there that's, that you approach with kindness and excitement, but they're deep down inside, they're hurting really bad and you don't know it. They, they just had a death in the family, they're bitter, they just, they're, they're having problems with their spouse, they just got in a car accident, they just found out they got a $10,000 hospital bill. You don't know what's going on in a human's life. So there's many different type of people that are gonna come at you. One of them is a hurting person. The second person is 
someone that is just bitter. <laughs> the third person is that they just have a different view and there's probably nothing you're gonna do to change that view on that first follow-up. And maybe over the months and years you could follow up with that person and maybe they change their view. But again, you're not gonna get everybody. No matter how good I think I am, I'm not gonna get everybody to get involved as a customer and or a business person. So just realize it's part of the process and uh, the best thing you can do is not get emotionally sidetracked and do the best that you can you can be to just keep, uh, keep building your business with confidence, with faith, Anyways, thank you so much for watching this live stream there. Please, if you're on the live stream, share it. If you're on YouTube over here, please subscribe and comment. Let me know that you're here. Let me know that you're watching the replay of this. Put your name in here, maybe where you're from, and uh, I look forward to seeing you. By the way, we are doing an event in San Diego. If you want to know more about it, comment, and we'll, we'll send you the link with a promo code or a discount code if there's still time. Um, but we're doing an event in San Diego on March 25th and 26th. You want to do whatever you can to get yourself there. It's going to be powerful. It's at a beautiful resort, the Kona Kai Resort. The, it's just a miracle. We got a crazy room rate for San Diego and uh, it's going to be filled with some amazing people. So anyways, I look forward to seeing you in San Diego or in our next video. God bless. See you soon.